at this studio, filled with glamorous prizes, fabulous and exciting merchandise, including this small wonder, a sporty $14,000 RX-7, and these beautiful $3,500 coral and diamond earrings. And surround yourself in luxury in this $6,000 mink coat. Over $96,000 just waiting to be won on Wheel of Fortune. And now, here's your host, Pat Sajak. Thank you, Pat Jack. Thank you all very much. Thank you, nice. Uh, welcome to Wheel of Fortune. And now, please join me in welcoming our lovely hostess. Here is Vanna White. Vanna. <laughs> They're ripping the coat off you, and she does it in four seconds. I don't know. Anyway, it's time to meet our uh, three players here. Uh, this is Peg Goldstein. How are you doing, Peg? Just fine, Pat. Uh, from uh, Marlton, New Jersey. Tell us about your life back in Marlton. Well, back in Marlton, I play some bridge. Yeah. And I play golf. Mm -hmm. I play uh, a bowl. I have two children, a uh, grown children, Jeff and Beth. And a husband. Well, you summed that up nicely. You do a little self-hypnosis. Yes, I do. Is that, I mean, you don't really like going to trances and things like that. Well, yes, I do. Do you really? Yes. Hmm, maybe we'll have time. We've never done that. Okay. At the end of the show, we'll have you Fine. put yourself into a trance. Okay. So, <laughs> probably mean two rating points for it. Good luck, you right. Thank you. Here is Rene Bouvier. Uh, I could say that for a month of Sundays. Oh, How wait, are you, Rene? Okay. Yeah. Mm, do you speak French? Um, no, I took a French class, but nothing. But you yeah. didn't pay much attention, apparently. Yeah. Uh, Rene is uh, from Las Vegas. What do you do back there? I'm a receptionist at the best convalescent hospital in Las Vegas. Okay. You were just you were told not to say the name or the name, but it's the best convalescent No, hospital. I give the name. But... All right. Well, I know you're not allowed. Okay. Skiing and dancing among your interests. Yeah. I wish you a lot of luck on our Thank show. Thank you. And here is uh, Doc Piper. Right. But you always want to put old in front of old Doc Piper, but you're not old. A couple of years from now, maybe. Yeah. Uh... <laughs> from Rochester, New York. Right. Uh, uh, Doc, a nick nickname, I think. Picked it up in college. Never made it through any of the important parts, but kept the nickname. Okay. <laughs> you have one child. Christopher. And you own a pro shop. Right, golf. Okay. Big sports fan, I would think. Oh, not as much as I can, you know, like to play, but we get out. Okay, you want to play our game? Sure. Good thing, $1,000, top dollar value for this round. Try not to hit bankrupt. If you do, you lose your cash, but not your merchandise, because once you buy a prize, it's yours to keep. Our first puzzle is a phrase. And just before the show, we drew numbers to see what starts the game. And Peg, it's going to be you. Good luck, hey. everybody. Here we go. Hey. Two hundred dollars start. Mm -hmm. May I have a tea, please? But there's no tea. Oh. Yeah. Renee. Come on, Will. Thousand dollars. Go. Oh, that's the same thing. Two hundred. Okay, I'd like an S, please. That we have. That's two S's. That's four hundred dollars for you. I'd like to spin. All right. Okay. I'd like an L, please. Nope, no L. Oh, it's been spin, 1,000. Like an H, please, Pat. And you'd like an H, if it happens to be one. That's a thousand dollars. No spin, yeah. Sorry, Peg. There you go, 900. May I have an N, please? Mm hmm, one N, that's $900. Keep it going. You said it? Oh, it's been six, sure can. Yeah. May I have an R, please? Why, yes, there. Oh, you have $1,500, Peg. What do you want to do? Um, I'll spin. Okay, good luck. Uh, come on, come on. You're six again, yep. I'll have an M, please. Why, you sure will. And now you have $2,100. Are you going to go on here? I'm going to solve the puzzle. Right, for all that money, what is this phrase? Sense of humor. Sure, that's it. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 
Rent a unit, $2,100. We'll go to the kids' room and you can spend all that money. Okay, for $5.99, I'd like the video camera. You've got it, and you still have about $1,500 left. For $7.49, the color TV. That goes to you, and that takes you down to $7.52. Uh, for $400, the wall co covering. $3.52. For... $2.89, the games. And that'll do it. The rest on either an American Express gift certificate or an account. How would you like to $68 worth, and the rest of the good news comes from our very own, and we're proud to say that, Jack Clark. <laughs> Thank you, Pat. Well, Peg, we start with John N. Hansen's assortment of games featuring Time the Game, exciting and challenging trivia questions on people, places, and events covering the last seven decades. It's from John N. Hansen Company, $284. And then Waverly Wall Coverings from the elegant French collection designed to beautify and customize one or more rooms in your home. Exquisitely, exquisitely designed wallpaper by Waverly. It's $400. And next, Konica's CV301 color video camera weighs only 1.6 pounds. It's designed for easy use. Features advanced video technology from Konica, $599. And finally, a new sharp 19-inch color TV with automatic sleep timer, wireless remote control, and 140-channel cable compatible tuner, $749. It is commercial time here at the old wheel. We'll be right back. Mm -hmm. I think we're going to go through right through there, okay? Yeah, yeah. I'm hoping to show you the game to be Second round, we still have $1,000 space on the wheel. There's a graphic on the wheel, too, Jack. What does that mean? You better describe it, Patrick. It's a limited edition graphic by Hiro Yamagata. It's entitled Aquarium. And this beautiful serigraph is numbered and hand-signed by the artist. It's from Martin Lawrence Galleries. It's $1,600, Jack. If you land on that special prize, it'll go into your account, and of course, if you solve the puzzle, that will be yours. I want to remind you, too, we have another bankrupt out there, and our next puzzle is a phrase. There it is, and Renee, you'll start it. She's pumping up, ready to go. Four hundred. Is there a T, please? Well, you like this. There are five T's. Not a bad way to begin. $2,000, I believe. Okay. Um, I'd like to buy a vowel. Okay. An E, please. Well, there is one E. That's enough to keep the going here. And another vowel, an O. There are four of those. So, very quickly, I have a lot of information up there. Okay, I'd like to spin. Do it. An N, please. One N, you have 1750. Okay, I'd like to spin. Come on, thousand. Let's go. And we have to hope for the best here. Boy. Four hundred. Okay. I would like a G, please. Good thing too, because there are three G's. And and if I know, you have two thousand nine hundred and fifty dollars. Okay, I would like to buy a vowel. Okay. A U, please. Man, I'm sorry, there's no U. Okay. Hang in there, we may get back okay. to your dog. I like the spin. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Mm, I'd like an F as in Frank, please. Yeah, two X. Eight hundred dollars, please. There they are. Let me spin again, please. Like 400 again. Like a D, please. Mm-hmm. Uh, can I get it? Oh. Two fifty. I like an S, please. There's your S. Now you have fourteen fifty. Are you going to continue? Yeah, I want to be sure it is. Six hundred. I'd like an R, please. One R. And the rest of all for the two thousand fifty dollar justice phrase. Getting off to a good start. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> uh, uh, 
right, every winning the game does improve uh, things, doesn't it? $2,050, the appliance center. What would you like from that area? Uh, for $469, a dishwasher. Okay, you have more than $1,500 to go. $1,581. For $449, the microwave oven. Okay, more than $1,100 left. For $818, the washer dryer. Now you have $314. For 150, the food hydrator. Okay, and that leaves you with 164 dollars. You want that on a gift certificate or an account? A gift certificate. Are you sure? Positive. Good. I sometimes I like to check. Like and you never have in, a, in, in this early stage of our relationship, Jack. Yes, Pat. Uh, Doc, let's look at these uh, fine gifts. First, Excalibur food dehydrator, fold-down removable door with no tray rotation required. Drying can be fun for the whole family by Excalibur, 150 dollars. And then the tap and sure cook microwave. Select a food or beverage, enter the quantity and how you'd like it done. It cooks your food automatically. Compete with built-in browner by Tappan, $449. Then, Gibson's portable dishwasher, featuring three levels of washing action, hygienic cycle, forced air drying, and energy saver system from Gibson, $469. Finally, enjoy washing flexibility. With this rugged, variable-speed Gibson Washmaster automatic washer, saves time and energy, plus matching automatic dryer with Gibson's vacuum you dry system for energy efficient drying power eight hundred eighteen dollars <laughs> So, we have just $50 separating the two leaders at this point with a $5,000 space on the wheel for the next round. So, obviously, a little math will tell you you are all in this thing. We'll be right back. This is round three. As promised, a lot of money on the wheel. Uh, we'll take a look at one space, for example, $5,000. How do you like that? Person is the category. And third round will be started by our third player. Doc, go get him. Oh, it's been hit. $300. Play an N, please. We have three N's for you. And that gets you off to a $900 start. I'd like a tea, please. There's one tea, yep. I'd like an hour, please. Oh, there are only three hours, Doc. I'm sorry. Poor guy. $16,150. I'd like to do? solve the puzzle, please. All right. Who's this person? President Ronald Reagan. That's it, yeah. <laughs> Ronald Reagan, over $16,000. We have some wonderful prizes. Some of them have wheels. Tell you what, we will take a break. We'll come back and find out how he spends all that dough. <laughs> Not bad. Oh, yeah. Did you spend over $16,000 during that commercial? That's what they told me. That's right. You have $14 left out of all that, which we put on a gift certificate. But listen to the prizes you purchased. Jack. Very nice things, Pat. Doc, we start with Oneida Silversmith.
Now, Doc, Mazda's rotary-powered RX-7. That with standard features like a five-feet overdrive, steel belted radials, and front and rear stabilizer balls, it's quick, nimble, economical from Mazda. Retail value, $14,193. $18,200. I guess that would make it a big winner uh, by a long shot. You're going to play the bonus round in a second, give you a chance right. to catch your breath here. Renee, I'm sure glad you came. I wish we had better news for you. but oh, we... that's right. I had fun. Good. I'm a glad you did. And we have some nice party gifts Thank for you. you. Thanks for being here. Uh, Peg, $2,100. That's not a bad uh, 20 minutes worth. Not bad at all. Enjoy all those parties. Thank Good you. to have you both here, but it's going to be Doc who is going to play the bonus round. We'll check with this Sneezy Dopey and all the rest and see what he wants to go for right after these words. You probably never heard that joke. Do you know all the seven dwarfs? Uh, I used to know two of them personally. <laughs> so I mean that, and then it would mention Doc going to commercial. I just thought after all the jokes you would know. Go ahead. You, you don't win anything for this. Can you do them? No, I don't think so. Doc, sneezy, bashful, grumpy, dopey, curly mo and Larry. Okay. <laughs> Happy. Thank you very much. Good night, everybody. Thank you for being... Oh, it's time to play our bonus round. I'm sorry. Listen, I'm all in good mood because you have already you already have a terrific car and $18,200 in prizes. What more could you possibly play for, he asked. The pearls, please. There is something else. Uh, here's Jack to tell you about those lovely pearls. They are gorgeous, too, Doc. And you'll be trying for a Tiffany gift certificate with which you might select this opera-length strand of eight and one-half millimeter creamy, high-luster rose pearls. They're gorgeous and they're eleven thousand dollars good luck all right our category this time is title and uh, you know how this works you give us five consonants and one vowel here we go i like a t that's one an r two an n three an l four and a g G, okay. And uh, now your vowel. E, please. It is. Okay, let's see how those choices work out for you. The audience, very quiet, please. Playing for beautiful pearls and over $29,000 in prizes. It is a title. You have 15 seconds to work it out, Doc. Good luck. It's a loan, uh, uh, love, the love, heat, love. That the uh, that that it beat you, and you didn't get it in in those 15 seconds. I am sorry. You were hot on the trail of it. I know. Now, folks. I'm only a conduit for the rules here. Uh, you did very nicely. You didn't get the pearls, but you know, I, they weren't you. As I have something I'm, to cheer us all up. I think this will do it. That's right. The key to Vanna's apartment. Congratulations. Oh. No. God. Just a little just a little joke to sort of lighten everyone's day. Did you hear that, Susie? A joke? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> what did you say? Susie's your wife. Yes. And you said that if you, if you won or purchased a car, as you did, that, uh, that what was the deal she made with you? Don't get into it? Don't get into it, please. With? Don't get oh, I was not allowed to get into it with Vanna. Yeah, I know. Susie has some strict house rules. But these keys are, in fact, of that great car. And your total, despite the bonus round, $18,200 in prizes. Nice going, Doc. Congratulations. I love when those totals get large. And we will do more of the same, more great prizes, more great puzzles, and more fun. Susie is on his way home. Everything is okay. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. Get in touch with Game Show Network. Log on to our website and play our games or email us your questions and comments. It's www.sony.com slash gameshownet. Or drop us a line via snail mail. Our address is Game Show Network, Post Office Box 805, Culver City, California, 90232. Furnished to the contestants prior to the show and been rounded off to the nearest dollar.